This Egyptian column killed six people and contains one of the weirdest time capsules around. In 1878, Britain was gifted Cleopatra's needle. The only problem was the 68 foot stone obelisk was in Egypt. So, always up for a pointless challenge, the British public put together 15,000 pounds in order to bring it over from Alexandria in Egypt. Then this specially designed cigar shaped container was built to ship it over, named the Cleopatra. But disaster struck when it started to sink off the coast of France. The ship towing it sent a boat of six volunteers to rescue the Cleopatra's crew, but the boat was swamped and volunteers drowned, with their names actually engraved at the base today. Eventually the crew was rescued, but the tow rope was cut, leaving this two million pound ancient Egyptian obelisk floating around for five days in the Bay of Biscay. When it was spotted again, no chances were being taken and a second ship was sent from England to bring her home, where she was greeted by roaring crowds. Nine months later, the needle was winched into position on the embankment and they all lived happily ever. Wait, that wasn't until some guy obviously thought, hey, should we put a time capsule in it? Leading to a hilarious mismatch of bizarre 1870s goods. That's in part two.